are you hiking the Pacific Crest Trail? I'm hiking because uh, it's something I've always wanted to do and I figure now's the perfect opportunity because I just got out of the military so I don't have anything else to do until I start college. So because of that and because um, after six years in the military I just don't feel like I'm living by my values anymore. So I'm kind of hoping to reconnect with myself and kind of uh, find myself on this journey as well. One mile down, only 2,649 more miles to go. Whew. Should be fun. Okay, so I'm at my first night camp and I'm all set up. Uh, today went pretty well. It was surprisingly tiring, especially once it got hot out, but I did take a pretty nice little nap in the shade. That's like the third hummingbird I've seen today. I, It's awesome, I didn't really think that There'll be a lot of hummingbirds, I don't know why not, just didn't occur to me, and there is, and it's great, and they're adorable. I've also seen like three hawks, and this really cool bird that was like bright yellow and black. I don't know what kind of bird it was though. Uh, so yeah, the first day is going pretty well. I'm excited to see what the next five or six months hold. Okay, so it is morning of day two. I started my morning with a climb up just like the biggest hill. It was very tiring, but now I'm kind of on the downhill side. I'm walking somewhere nice and flat right now, so I figured I'd do my morning vlog. Uh, oh, bunny. Anyway. I am uh, trying to make it to at least a uh, Hodger Creek today. So uh, about nine miles. I might go a little further if I'm feeling uh, good because uh, it's super overclass today and it's kind of misty, which is great because it's warm. I mean, it's nice and cool and there's a bit of a, a nice little sprinkle going on. So we're gonna keep pushing through and uh, should be a pretty good day. Day two, woo! Ant Highway, Highway for Ants. I just want to say, I fucking hate hills. Oh my god, so much uphill. Oh, and then I just have to go downhill, so I can go up another one. It's ridiculous. I think the flat earthers are onto something. Much better, much better for one. Day three and I'm about a half mile from my campground. I'm at about 
5.5 miles, I think, on the PCT. And I just had my first water crossing. There's this little stream that's a log walk across. But, uh, first one. Hopefully, the rest are just as easy. So it's the morning of day four. I haven't filmed much the last kind of day and a half because it's been really rainy. You can see it's still pretty overcast today, but this is supposed to be the last day of it. So when I started the PCT, I decided to go Nobo because I figured it'd be easier. I was starting in the desert, right? So the desert's flat. It should be easy. Well, let me tell you, this desert is not flat. There are just hills abound that you have to go up and then go down. And going down is almost worse than going up because every time you go down, you can look ahead of you and see where the trail starts to go up again. <laughs> And you just know, oh God, I have to go up that. It can be kind of demotivating, to be honest. But one of the things that I have found to be really motivating is to keep looking back at where I came from. To see that I've already come really far. You know, I've only come about 27 miles as of right now. I'm only going to mile 30 today. That's the plan, anyway. But, looking back at where you've been, you can be like, oh shit, I already came down that hill and that one. Wow. Thank you for watching my first few days in the PCT. I really look forward to recording the rest of my journey to share with you. If you liked the video, please hit the like button or subscribe. Uh, thanks again for watching, and I hope you have a great day.